Hi, Fred, and other viewers. Um, something you said uh, kind of uh, piqued my, uh, I don't know, I got my brain going uh, when you said that um, free will or willpower is uh, seems to be something contradictory. And, uh, I don't know, it kind of got my, uh, you know, the gears rolling. And um, I came upon the thought, or the question, is free will um, self-contradictory? Uh, self and it kind of makes me look at, at our concept of freedom not as free will, but the other, the other kind of freedom, uh, which is, uh, I guess, political freedom. And um, you'll, whenever you talk about political freedom, uh, I think, or whatever I talk about it, it always comes up in the conversation how um, you can't have complete political freedom um, because if everyone was allowed to do anything they wanted, then no one really would be allowed to do everything they wanted because if one because if one person wanted to, let's say their will was to completely subdue all of their neighbors and like steal all of their resources, maybe that's what he wanted to do. And uh, the problem is that chances are the other pe his neighbors aren't want to, going to want to submit. So no one can have complete political freedom. Really, the the if, if the most perfect thing you can have is that everyone has freedom to do what they want. Um, as long as it doesn't infringe on the freedom of others. Now, what I thought is that can this line of reasoning carry to um, freedom in the sense of uh, of willpower, uh, the power of the will, the other kind of, of freedom that, that we're talking about right now? And I th I think well I suspect that it does, and that the con the concept of free will can, well it might uh, be a victim of this kind of self-contradictory situation. Um, if I have free will, it means that I can do whatever I want with, with I mean I'm not going to be naive and say I can do whatever I want, like I can rock it up to the moon. No, like I have, there's physical limitations. I can do what I want with what I have. Um, what happens is that uh, other people can do what they want with what they have. And really what other people have is everyone else because we're all part of the same world. Um, if, I was, uh, if I was next to you, I could uh, I have a fist, I have your face, I can punch you in the face. But you don't want to be punched in the face, but it's going to happen any anyways. But don't you possess your own body? Don't you have uh, control over the situation? No, you don't. Well, if I not if I catch you by surprise. Um, so there comes all these limitations, um, and and what happens is that my free will is binding on your free will, and maybe maybe it does come down to the fact that. Um, in the end, you can't really have free will in that sense of free will being separate from uh, from the physical world and free will kind of inserting its 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 volition into the world and making things happen um, without uh, I guess without influence uh, of of everything around you. Um, I don't know if I'm being coher coherent here. I have no idea, but. Um, the idea kind of makes sense to me um, that what happens is that you just have so many things that can infringe upon what you want to do with what you have that with the free will just seems to uh, fall apart in that sense um, really what I want to see how I see free will is more like some uh, um, something that you have um, but only at, at a, in a certain frame of reference like like I have I've, I've, my free will is is that I can do what I want with with what I have and and that's pretty much all it comes down to that's that's really my only definition um, 
and, and like what I want it is I have to say that you know it is determined by previous events I think like I am what I think I am like what I am like I am my experiences and the, the culmination of all that and uh, if that's determined I mean I know there's like there's a, always like randomness there's an element of randomness in the, in the universe so it's not like determined um, but I do think it is determined by uh, by my previous experiences and uh, free will I think is just a description I think of, of just uh, my capacity as a culmination of those experiences to do what that personality wishes um, as opposed to these kind of sentiments that oh, man, like we're prisoners of um, of uh, some sort of human nature I, I mean fine I mean you know there's there's things that come with being a human being but I don't think that those uh, override um, our personal desires, whether it be to, uh, I don't know, be a more moral person, or to be a vegetarian, and to go against your kind of uh, meat-eating uh, instincts. But I guess that's off-topic. Um, yeah, this video was kind of a, a mess. But uh, that's that's pretty much that's pretty much um, what I want to say, or what I want to ask. You know, is free will as a concept uh, self-contradictory? Hmm. It could be. It could very well be.